Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today I have another inspired look for you. I actually got this of the Cosmopolitan, the Cosmo. I don't know how well you can see it. It's basically orange, pink, and then on top of it is white. Now, I don't have a white shadow, but I will use my Meron palette here, which is body paint, and you can use it all over the eyes and all over the face. Yeah, it's just a nice, warm and spring type of look, if that makes sense. So, let's get started. Say hello to this. I brought some face cream with me from my boyfriend's place, which he had for like three years. And I figured, you know what, it's probably still good. It's not. This, and then it's very itchy, and I decided to get rid of it. So I'm sorry you have to live with this. I don't really have an orange shade here, but I want to use the one that I'm currently using for my panda palette, and that is Raw Sienna. Looks like this. It's not really orange, so I'm going to use this. On the inner corner and then like halfway such a beautiful shade I, I use this all of the eyelid uh, with nothing else you know then just blend it in and then do a wink liner and that's it and I also take it underneath on my lower lash line so we got that done yay then I brought this palette with me, the Luvia Matte Mosaic, Matte, Matte Mosaic palette. And we're going to use this here. This is called Fuchsia Rose. It's one of the very few pink shades that I have in my collection. So I'm tapping up the brush and I'm going to use the other side to put that on the outer corner. Okay, that's not as vibrant as I thought it would be. Okay, we're going to build it up. Oh god, that's Patches at hell. Oh no. Hold on. I'm gonna use the finger for this. Oh, there's a little bit better. A tiny bit. Okay. Okay, we're getting there, we're getting there. It's actually nice, but then again. Is it really worth it to use a shadow only with your hands? What is this hair? Oh my god, did you hear my belly? Oh my god, I'm hungry. I'll blend it. Yeah, see, as soon as I blend it in, it takes off the color underneath. Oh no. So that's not good. I feel like I have to do a how well does perform with this palette as well. Which, by the way, is coming soon, the next one. Uh, I'm actually waiting on my Look Fantastic box. Strangely, I got the email saying that it has been shipped on the 10th. No, not, not that it has been shipped, it has... I know that the um, shipment has been announced. That's the email that I got on the 10th. Now we are the 15th, and there's still no update. I still have so many package, packages and orders that need to come in, but it's somehow just not updating. Now, I get it, you know, with COVID and everything is a bit slower, but at least give them an update. You know, at least tell me, oh, your package has arrived at the destination or something. But no, it's just weird. Anyways, I'm going to use my blending shade here. This is Tempera from ABH. I'm just going to blend in, trying to not touch the pink. Okay, then I'm gonna use I'm gonna use this brush here, a very flat shade of brush, and my face paint that I can find it oh, here it is, in the middle of the eyelid. God, I'm actually so nervous, why am I so nervous? Like, doing one eye is fine, but then have the other one match. Oh, you just know how this is going to work out. Spoiler alert, not well. It's to come up much higher. God, why is my belly making so much noise? It could be worse, it could be worse. Oh god, now matching this to the other. Oh god. Uh, 
kind of. So anyway, what's up? How are you holding up? I think COVID updates from my country. All the measurements that they have put, you know, like cafes are closed, bars are closed, restaurants are closed. All of that will go on until the 14th of March. Maybe I'm just too rational or maybe I'm just too much of an adult and a grandma at heart. But how can schools be open and kids and students have to wear masks for so long and it works apparently, but the restaurants have to be closed? Can someone tell me how that makes sense? Cinemas are open, but the restaurants are closed. You can go shopping, grocery shopping and normal shopping, but you can't go to a bar. Think about that. And yeah, we still have curfew from 11 to 6. I mean, the curfew thing, I don't really go out anyway, so it doesn't really bother me. But do you really think the virus is the most active at night? You know, on one hand, I'm happy that people get fined if they are out after curfew. But on the other hand, like, don't, do you really have nothing else to do than, than focus your energy and controlling people if they're outside after 11 or not? Don't we have other problems in this country right now? And I feel like once they give us a new date, you know, like, let's say, given the fact that we have the measurements until the 14th, let's say on the 10th, they will do a press conference. You know, you look forward to that day, but as soon as it happens, you know, they were just gonna expand the measurements and it will go on for even longer. And I feel like it's, it's a circle. Like, it's, it's like, we're never getting out of this. And I know a lot of other countries are doing the vaccines, which is good. But over here, it's taking so long. Honestly, if, if we go on um, as fast as we are currently, I will be vaccinated by 2030. We have like, I think 20,000 people vaccinated right now. We are a small fucking country. We don't even, we don't even have a million citizens living here. 20,000 are vaccinated. Maybe I should go into politics because all of this just pisses me off and makes absolutely no fucking sense. Uh, just let me use concealer. I'm going to use this concealer because I have it here and it's the one that I always use when I do videos like this. Where's the fallout coming from? I just cleaned it up. I really need to do a how well does perform with that palette because apparently it's not performing very well. Wait, didn't, didn't, I, didn't I lose my thought there with the panda palette? Yes, I'm getting my um, Blue Fantastic box apparently between the 16th and the 18th, which I'm highly doubting that because it has not been updated whatsoever. And then I do a mask, first impression, like this time an actual mask, a face mask, not a hand mask. And then I think it's time for another How Well Does Perform. Because there are not that many shades left. This is the one I would do that series on. Can you see? So I would do these two, and then these two, and then three more videos on this palette. And I really want to get it done. And I also want to use it because it's something my brain tells me. Like, let's say I use this shade now on the regular basis and I hit pan on it or maybe even possibly use it up and I haven't done a video on how well does it perform that would give me so much anxiety you know like to have started with this palette but not finish it so I'm, I'm not even touching this palette right now because I'm just too scared to hit pan and use something up oh god I really gotta set my priorities straight oh my god also yeah that's it for the COVID update we don't have anything else going on but both and I we often used to do that we have an open bookshelf here like a public bookshelf and next to it is also a like a public shelf where you can put glasses or, I don't know, like some jackets and bowls and other things. Does that make sense? And toys for kids, for example. And we always did that uh, on Friday night, you know, like midnight, <laughs> because, I mean, it's Friday night. So, and we can't do that. And of, of course I could go now, but it's just weird going there through the, during the day and have like a whole bag of books. It's just weird. I also, I don't like going out and meet people, so I will say that at night. I hope that everything will be better soon. I, I don't think so. Then I'm just quickly going to use Precious Cargo from the Baby Yoda palette and just... I've not blended this in. Oh, put that into my inner corner here. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, I love this palette so much. And I broke it. Okay, then I'm going to use my mascara. I actually bought a new one by Max Factor, which I also know is not cruelty free, but... What are you going to do? And I basically just bought it because it's the cheapest one. I think it was like five bucks. L'Oreal has mascara for 14 euro. For 14 euro for mascara? What the hell? Is that made out of gold? Are you mad? Jesus. Like, it's still L'Oreal. Okay, it's not 
it's not Too Faced or, or Armani or Gucci or whatever, right? It's L'Oreal. You know, I have an Etsy store where I sell like, you know, like vintage items. I went to the post office and right next to it is a, like a little store where you can get magazines and newspaper, but also like candy and postcards, you know, something like that. What do you call Anyways, you can get the newspaper job. So I went there because I ran out of gum in my car and I always need to have a pack of gum. I don't know why. It's not that I chew a lot of gum, but I want to have it. So I went and bought a like a pack of those like the plastic tops of Mentos gum and I bought some Mentos itself. Five euro and four cents. The hell? Everything is so expensive nowadays. What is this? I think that that roll or that pack of Mentos was like one euro. What's going on? It's so expensive. Okay, then for the lips. I'm just gonna use this. This is a clear lip gloss by Essence. I don't really like it that much, but I'm gonna use it anyways. Oh, that's it. That's the finished look. I actually like this much more than I thought I would. Hmm. Okay, so anyway, that was it. I hope you enjoyed this look. Did I nail it? I mean, I kind of did though, right? I like this look, but I don't know if I would sit down for so long and try to get this this white shade on and make it look good and even. You know what I mean? I don't have time for that. But if it was a special occasion, I would probably, maybe. So I hope you enjoyed this. Give me a thumbs up if you did. Subscribe to my channel already, and it's the next one.